man, that clip was so messy in every way possible, but uh, it ended up paying off, you know? Now it's a long clip with a lot of build-up, but it actually has a payoff, who would have thought? First drop of the day, a beautiful fucking Philo Claw, that makes me so happy. Hopefully we can sell that one a bit quicker, buy a chasm bow, finish off the rest of Hydra, who knows, maybe we'll see another Philo Claw later, you never fucking know, or maybe even just superior heights, those 15 build drops add up too, don't get me wrong. And then uh, once we reach the 1kkc, whatever we have left over we can spend on other upgrades, but uh, at that point I want to start doing a mix and mash of like raids when I have people to raid with, maybe like normal chambers, to 500kc, and start working on those challenge modes that we talked about earlier. Um, yeah, I'm really gonna try my best to just grind it out today, I'm not gonna lie, just get this Hydra part over with so it doesn't take too many videos to catch up with it, but uh... Yeah, I, I, it's beautiful, ain't it? <laughs> this is what I enjoy doing on the uh, on this particular account, like the obscure money makers. I think everyone kind of knows by now that Hydra is a good money maker to begin with, but I don't think anyone has ever done like a loot from kind of Hydra thing to this extent. I haven't, anyway. I never really tracked my kills here and anything like that. Ugh. Let's hope we can uh, spawn one more Philo in this hour and then I'll check you guys if it does, and if not, I'll see you at the end of the hour. Alright, last kill of the hour. Wow, shit wore off just before it died. Typical. One more spawn? Aww. Oh. Well, like I said last night, I do not mind getting a superior only once in the hour when it drops a fucking Philo Claw. That, you know, you are excused, so to say. It's okay. We'll live with that. Um, yeah, gonna do another hour very soon. Closing in. I think one or two more hours should be enough to finish it off. So yeah, let's get that over with. It, it, it does get a little bit dragged out at this point, I will admit. It's all very click intensive. I don't always feel like starting a new hour because when I start, I can't take breaks. And it's all because of those poopy little holiday scrolls. If you're just Elixir, you can log out, take a piss, no problem. But when you have those scrolls going, ooh, don't want to waste them, I only have a few. I was thinking if, if we get exceptionally lucky and made a bit more money, maybe I could just buy a full chest clear, like another, like, However many tokens it is to finish tier 1 and tier 2, and then enough tokens to finish tier 1 a second time, just so we stock up on those scrolls and we can use them for like challenge mode related shit. I thought that might be a good idea, but um, for now though, I'm gonna have smoke again. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, just came back from dinner and look at that, the Philo Claw has, claw, <clears throat> Philo claw has already sold for 70 bill. Wonderful price, I mean it's a bit lower than I would have wanted, but... They can be a bit rough to sell and I didn't want to wait too long for that. With that, our cash tag now grows to a whopping, astounding, incredible 154 bill. Let's see if that's enough to buy chasm bows that are, that are in the trading post potentially. 145? Yeah, just rip out the band-aid and get rid of it. Honestly, we're making so much more than I had originally expected. Now we have a Dragon Hunt the Lance Eye still and we got the Chasm Quaker Bow. So, uh... That is pretty wonderful. Just gotta finish off the 1000 Hydras, because that's the goal I set for myself. And then uh, we'll start moving on to other stuff. This is a wonderful unlock. I guess maybe Crestroot next up, or Armor Mosaic. Crestroot is probably better to have, just for other stuff as well. Alright, started another hour, but without the uh, Superior Squirrel, because I might have to leave it a little bit for the dog's dinner time. But uh, after that, we'll do another hour with the Squirrel. I think that second hour should be enough to finish off the kills. We'll have to wait and see how close we get, and otherwise go a little bit over. Not that big a deal, but uh, yeah, this uh, this Hydra grind has brought me a lot more than I had originally uh, hoped for, honestly. I was just thinking if we can make our Chasm Bow from this place, that would be a wonderful thing to have, but we're walking away with not just the bow now, but also the lance. That's definitely beyond my expectations. We're not even done yet, who knows, maybe we'll end up seeing another claw, I wouldn't even be that surprised. It is a very high drop rate after all. 1 in 25 is, generally speaking, not that hard to hit. <clears throat> On average. I mean, obviously some people still end up going dry and such. But uh, we are getting the long end of the stick. Wait, or is that the opposite of what you want? <laughs> We're getting the good stuff. So yeah, hopefully uh, this hour can spawn a few more files. Honestly, even if we get nothing else with the remainder of the kills, I would still be satisfied with what we got, but, you know, going beyond that, it's, you know, you still hope. Shaking my head off, seems like the RNG isn't as good when you're not using a scroll. 
About to finish the hour here, but uh, not a single philosophers. The kills were a bit slower than usual. <clears throat> I feel like there's a little bit of a delay going on, which ironically enough is mainly noticeable when I try to unalive myself with the Dwarven Rock Cake. It just takes a little while for that thing to show up and then like actually register the hits. Like, you see what I mean? That shit took a minute there, man. And uh, yeah, you end up wasting quite a bit of time doing that every kill. Also, I just hate how it closes the interface when you put it on 1 HP, so you can't instantly do the 1 HP after. <laughs> you know, good quality of life suggestion, maybe I'll post that, but uh, would be nice if it had the right click options of like, eat and guzzle, and then like, one is the lower HP by one, and the other is to instantly go to 1 HP or something. Alright, gonna go ahead and start another hour. Um, don't think it's gonna be enough to finish off, but like an additional 20 or so kills after the hour. Let's see how it goes. Hopefully a bit better than the previous hour. Got the dog with me. My background noise, he's a little overly energetic. Fun times. But uh, let's hope for a good hour. Yeah, that is surely better than the last hour, ain't it? Not even 10 minutes in for the first one. Beautiful. Oh, let's just hope this is a wonderful hour. Alright, about to die. Wow, how did that prayer miss? The game is a little laggy. Uh, good luck. Another file claw. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's hope we spawn another one soon. That would be nice. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Just at the half hour mark for yet another spawn. Let's see what this one has in store for us. I'm really hoping for one more claw so we can do our very overpriced elite wonderer. That would be sick. Not counting on it though, but you know, I can hope. Good luck. Oh, nothing. Alright, big W right here, another Philo with 24 minutes to go, beautiful. Come on, man. One more claw. Okay, good luck. Yep, here we go. Hang on. No, it's nothing again. Honestly, now that I think about it, we've seen a fair share of uh, Philos. It's kind of crazy we haven't seen a single epic pet box or a pet yet or anything like that, really. Just the fucking claws and superior highs and then a few of the ring pieces, but uh, I just realized that I used to do Philo specifically for the epic pet boxes on MGI because it gave him so consistently, but we haven't seen a single one yet. Kind of strange. I don't think the drop rate on that in particular was changed, just the other items around it. Weird. But uh, I don't know. Maybe we can spawn one more in the last 50 minutes, maybe right here. That would have been beautiful, but uh, hope, 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 because there's not many kills left after this. Probably elixir for the next hour, but not use the superior scroll, so that we can use the remaining time on like hunt left or something. Hey, we got one in the final minute. Well, I'll be damned. Could we snatch one final Philo claw here? Let's find out. All right, here we go. This is gonna be. I don't know what KC this is at. Kill it. 34. Yeah, I think that smells like a doubled Philo Claw. <laughs> oh my god! Doubled leather and an epic pet box. We were just talking about that. That's a wonderful triple drop, man. Epic pet box, doubled leather? No, it's not a doubled leather. It didn't double. It's just straight up the two times leather drop. That is sick as fuck. Yeah, we'll add that to the list. Holy fuck. Let's check out the epic pet box for a little bork. Oh, speaking of triple drops, god damn. That dude got the juice as well. That is a wonderful kill. Double letter, man. Fuck yeah. Epic pet box into a Bork. Imagine, two pet upgrade accessories though. That is still a very nice one if you ask me. And a, another one has entered the field, my dudes. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Another chance of making it big. All right, should kill it on the next hit. Any back-to-back -back rares? Let's find out. No pet or anything either, sadly. Well, boys, like three kills later, we see another one. Honestly, impeccable RNG. Like, I could, I can't even complain about the drops. I can't complain about the spawn rate. This is so not me. Number 36 here. Come on, man. Another final claw for the boy. I could really use the money, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna, by the way, I ended up buying one extra superior letter. People are undercutting the fuck out of it. Last time I got some, I sold them for 15 bill each, and they sold in the same day. Took no time at all. Now idiots are selling it for 11 bill. Good luck. 
Uh, they are undercutting it so fucking hard. I don't understand why, because it already sells quick. So I figured, you know what? I'll buy the cheap cheapest one, the one at 11 bill, because that's just so fucking cheap. And then I'll try and resell it for 15. Now, I'm gonna just have to be patient on that, because I think next Monday, when the Wanderer resets again and more people will get, you guessed it, superior leather tasks, maybe enough will be bought that mine will end up buying as well. That's kind of what I'm hoping for here. What is happening, guys? I just can't <laughs> I can't stop spawning them. What the fuck? All right, let's finish him off. Oh, God. oh no, Miss Prayer. And now it's dead. Good luck. Oh, my ring. No. It's because the ring that does nothing while you have a grand elixir going on. I didn't have it on. That's what killed the kill for me. Well, guys, you wouldn't fucking believe it. 999. Hydrak AC, I spawned one more file up. Amazing. I, I was just saying to the boys, because we're in the voice chat with a skeleton and ghost. Oh, imagine if I get one on the last kill. Not the last kill, but the second to last. Works for me. Got the epic luck out. Let's see if we can end the 1000 loot from with a file club to end it all. That would be fucking insane. Come on, here we go. Hit 100. No, one more hit. Surely. Yep, yep. One more club, please. Oh, another epic pet box though. I mean, that is still pretty damn good. Hey, and a Crespi's one. Not a claw, but I'll gladly take it. Let's open it up. Uh, you know what? Since we're one kill off, I'll just finish the final kill and then we'll open it. Oh, one thousand kills completed. It is done, boys. Uh, obviously, I have some elixirs ticking, so uh, I don't want to waste too much time right now to go over the loot, but we will go over it. After I do my hunt left daily first, and then I'll probably spend the remainder of my elixir at hunt left to be honest, just to see what we can get. But we do get another epic pet box, and I want to quickly see if we get something nice from it. You never know. Weird looking Bork. Just to show you the log on the regular so far, 1000 KC on the dot, and we're still missing the regular Hydra letter to complete it. Quite a lot of other drops though, but that doesn't mean everything, because it doesn't show what doubled and all of that. So uh, we'll go over that in just a little bit as well. But first, gonna finish off the remaining elixir time. What an amazing loot from it has been, though. I can't lie. Like, god damn, we made a lot of money from this. Hey, boys, second hunt left kill, and we get a tormented crystal shot. A singular one, but I'll take it nonetheless. Whoa, 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 whoa. We just got another 10 tormented shot drop. What the fuck, bro? The second time we've gotten that, and we barely have any hunt left KC at all. I ain't got shit from Hunt Left so far. Wait, where's the log? Hunt Left, Hunt Left, Hunt Left. Look, I got zero items on my log, and the only rare drops I've had in 24KZ is the 10 Tormented Shard twice. That is incredible. That's by far the best drop you can get. 